<laughs> Guys, you ready for your big day? Uh, oh, here you go, big fella. <laughs> You see, we have our friend here, the crazy cat. So I'm just warming up the water for them now. We're gonna begin our bath. Huh. The water's gonna warm up. You don't wanna be cold. You don't wanna be cold. High caliber. Okay, let's get down to the cat. Oh, water's getting warm, guys. So, it's our first bath. Figured we'll just do it all together because there's only six of them. They're running from the water. The cat's playing with them. Gentle on them. 
Are you going somewhere, boy? Handsome boy? I just had breakfast. Now you had a bath. I know. You got a crusty color, little lady. Go all in, huh? Get that collar a little bit cute off in it. I know. Gosh, you guys are six weeks old today. We gotta give you a bath to celebrate. Nobody's looking for celebrations. No one's looking for it. Let's get the soap off. Let's get the soap off. Thank you. I know. I'm sorry, but you need a bath. Oh, yeah, you guys gotta get used to baths when you're big boys. You getting yourself a drink, Teddy? Oh, Teddy, you're so sweet. Everybody's done. I think everybody's done. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Good boy. Big cute. Yeah. It's not so bad. It's not so bad, puppy. You didn't get the bath, lady. We did. You want your face washed off? You want your face dried off, handsome? <laughs> So, needless to say, they weren't a fan of the bath, but that happens, but they need to get used to having baths because the more you get them used to it, the easier it's going to be on you when they get older. Huh. You forgive me? Do you forgive me, little boy? Huh? I know, Caliber. This is Luch. Better. You got your bedding in there. You just dry bedding. You guys can take it at night. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Hey, You're all going to go back in your bed. girl Kira she's a real sweet girl she's a spunk of the bunch yeah and the kitty's biting me I should have took your claw off too hi hi handsome you look fabulous girl and you smell wonderful oh I see your friends back I see your friends back the kitty cat would you like to go next, little lady? This is the purple collared girl. Still awaiting a name for this little lady. Huh. Oh, goodness. You are such a champ, you two. 
Yes, you was a champ too, buddy. I know. Did you drink too much water? Yeah. I don't know what this lady is expecting us to take a bath. We did not like it. You better get used to it. Yes, you better get used to it, you two. The last little baby. Oh, you is. Someone's got to be last. This is our little green collar boy. He is currently still available. He's the last one out of the litter. But he's looking for a home. He's super. He's a cuddler. He's a good size, too. He's a good size boy. Good size boy. So our bath is over. How do we feel? Do we feel fabulous? Because you look it. I'm not going to lie. You're all looking pretty spiffy. You are. Yes, you are. You feel good. Oh, you look great. You look great. Yes, I know. You're cold. I'm going to let you guys cover up with a blanket. Hi. Hi. Hi, sweet girl. Your little ear. Yes, you've got little ears wet. Why don't you guys take a little nap? Yeah? What do you think? No? All right. So, we're going out today, too. It's in the afternoon, but I'm going to bring them out to a different spot in the yard so they can actually have an enclosure they can go in and play in. Violet's watching them from afar. Yeah, Violet, you'll bistro. Yeah, look at this, guys. We've got a setup for you guys in here. Yeah. Can chew on leaves. Let's see. Take this plastic out of here. We don't want you chewing that. Or eating caterpillars. Throw all that stuff out. I bought a blanket for you, too. Hi, Teddy. Mr. Ruxpin. Look at our little faces. Oh, don't you be the crybaby. Who got dirt on your ear? You just had a bath the other day. All right, guys, let me put down a thing. So if you want to sit on there, you can. So I put their, I put a blanket down here in case they want to take a nap. Um, I'm going to have them eat dinner out here too tonight. But they'll go poop in here, I'm sure. And they'll go pee. Teddy's got a leaf in his mouth. Wow, this is pretty nice, huh, puppies? This is pretty nice. <laughs> That's Kira. She's a pink collar on. I took Teddy's collar off because he was out rowing it. This is purple collar, but she has a different color collar on. She has a little puppy collar on. His collar's off too because they took a bath. So I wanted. Hi. Hi, 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 hi. I wanted to get them washed. So, that's that. Hmm. Checking things out. They all seem to be doing pretty good. I did put a blanket down in case they wanted to lay down. Take a nap. Whoops, they go running and they don't realize the fence is there and they're boing. This is only like a, I don't know, 10 by 4 or 10 by 5 enclosure. It's not super big, but... We keep it for these for this purpose usually. Huh. They're loving it. They love this. So it is nice out today. So I figured, oh yeah, gotta come see me. Yeah, come on, come on, everybody, come see me. <laughs> Hi, babies. Hi. Hi. Thank you, Teddy. Look at me. Oh, aren't you the sweetest puppy I ever did see? And Violet is watching us from afar. She said, what do you got over there? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Auntie Violet. But they're all like on my lap. So, are your puppies lovable? Yes, they are. Look at this little guy. So this is a green colored boy. He's still looking for a home. He's the only one out of the litter. He's super cute. And he's a snuggler, as you can tell. He's right on my lap. They're all pretty lovable. Is that a car? Oh my gosh, Caliber. Oh no, that's the UPS. UPS driver. Yep. That's the UPS driver. This is Kira. Giving kisses. She has a name. She has a home now. Little Kira. I love the name. That's the first one we had. What's going on over there? Hi, handsome. Hi, boys. Hi, you little boys. This is nice, huh? Oh my gosh. All I see is these little tongues coming. 
spike. Yes, you guys are good puppies. Good, good, good puppies. Hi. <laughs> Luch is right here on my lap, giving me the best kisses ever. Look at that little face. He's so sweet. Where are you going? They're actually all right here. Caliber. What? You're on my lap. You can see who the venturer is. Her. Be bopping around. He's over checking things out too. So is Teddy. Teddy said, I'm a big guy. I'm a big boy. Hi, Teddy. <laughs> yes, they're so pretty, the little black puppies in the sun. They're shimmery. So shimmery. Yeah. But, um, so it's in the late afternoon, but I figured the sun wouldn't be bright and it's still nice and beautiful out today. So I love this time of year to let the little puppies out and they're looking at the grass and checking things out. It's awesome socialization for them. They can hear the cars go by. Um, it's okay. Yeah, those are cars. Yeah, you guys are going to all be driving in cars one of these days soon. A couple of weeks, you guys have your big day. So these guys, oh my gosh, look at that face. You are so cute, Teddy. Are you chewing on the camera, handsome fella? Um, <laughs> do you see her over there? That is a purple collared girl. She still is yet to have a name. Chewing on the fence. Oh, we got a rebel. And she's like one of the small ones. Her and... Is it Caliber or Looch? Is, I think it's Looch is actually one of the other small ones, but you can tell this is Teddy. He's kind of a big guy. He's a big guy. Yeah, he's a good boy. But he's so, like, he doesn't look overweight. He's just big. He's just, like, just big. Sorry, lady. But they are having the time of their life. They're chewing on old leaves. There has been no birds in here going potty. Um, so... Um, I leave it shut so nobody comes in here because our, our birds do free range, but we have had a lot of bob, we have a bobcat, we've decided it's a bobcat and it's been actually jumping our six foot fence and eating our baby turkeys from the spring, so I'm really disappointed and I've, we've tried everything, but I actually put bob wire on the top of the fence and that seems to have done the trick so far. We shall see though. Oh, you're so... Looch is on my lap again, giving me kisses. Looch. Oh my gosh, you should take him to the Let me show you. Look at this. And I got... <laughs> I got the little purple collar girl, too. He is a love bug. I hope you guys are ready for him. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes, I know you're a lovely girl, too. I got it. Oh, that's my ear. She's eating my ear. You're lucky you're cute. Hi, hi handsome. Trying to get everybody, but they're all over the place. This is the little green collar boy. This is Teddy. Look how shiny Teddy is. And they all, you guys saw the video, they all hated their bath. Like I was killing them, huh Teddy? Yeah, you little speckled boy. You have the biggest paws. He said, I want to get on your lap too, lady. So this is, let's see, this is Teddy trying to get on my lap. Isn't he precious? He's such a good boy. Oh, Teddy, you're so handsome. You're so handsome, Teddy. You're so handsome. <laughs> Hi, girl. Hi, Sassafras. Maybe that's what we should name you. Sassafras. So, Mom is totally off with these guys, like I told you before. Um, isn't he precious? He's licking my leg. <laughs> he said, I'm already done playing. Where's lunch? Where's my dinner? Here's my dinner lady. Hi. Hi, Caliper. Came over to say hi to me too. Oh, good. Oh my god, somebody's running little circles until he bopped into the fence. What are you doing? Trying to get some grass, big fella? Are you trying to get some grass? Huh? Oh, you have pretty eyes. Yes, you do. <laughs> They're not used to the fence, so they keep running and banging into it. It's the funniest thing. These two are cute. She's the only one with this white tip tail for the blacks. You go, boy. What you doing, Kira? 
Oh, thank you, Teddy. Looking me up some more. Awful nice kid he is. Oh, hi. You want to give me kisses? Oh, thank you. I will take them. I'll take them. <laughs> they all loving it. So this is the fun part about having summer fall puppies. Yes, they get to come out. <laughs> so they get more socialization than everybody else. I can't kiss you all the time. You know, I can't kiss you two boys. What do you got on your ear caliber? I got a little bit of crusties from lunch. Yes, caliber. Oh, you a new boy. Mwah. He's so sweet. They are so sweet. I see Violet gave up from watching us. She got tired. What, caliber? What? They were dewormed again. Six weeks. We didn't have any issues this time. Last time when we dewormed, that's when they all caught the virus. Or it just happened to be at the same timing. Not all of them. Only actually three of them ended up getting it. So that was good. What? But um, it just happened to show up. So I was kind of nervous when I dewormed him again. But I didn't think it was a dewormer. We've been using that for years. That's Kira. We've been using it for years. Oh, look at this. He's out climbing up. And we've never had any problems. So I kind of suspe suspected it wasn't that. But it happens. Hi, big fella. Hi, big fella. You're a calm little boy. Yes, you are. Yes. They're having a so yeah, I suspected it wasn't the dewormer, and it wasn't because I gave it to them. They just had it this last Thursday, and nobody had any issues. So it's just a virus they caught, and it happens. A little butt. As I told you, he's super lovable. Um, so it does happen. Chewing on stuff. Are you gonna be a chewer? I think so. I think I might. And then they will be dewormed again one more time at eight weeks. And that is like a series of three different times. So, um, but you still have to bring them to be dewormed again with your vet just to be, every puppy is a preventative. It is a preventative that you want to do. Look at little butts. <laughs> Hi, are you back over to kisses? You guys have to be the sweetest puppies ever. All six of ya. So yeah, we even our big dogs, we um, deworm throughout the year too, just as a preventative. It's better to do that than to um, not even realize, because sometimes you don't see it. Aren't you spunky? And then, um, yes, you boys. I have um, Caliber and Looch right over here. Scratching me up, trying to get up closer and closer. Uh, uh, uh. Yes, I love you too. This is Looch. Here comes Caliber again. And they're all in here. They love to be loved. We just love to be loved. Hi. Hello. Hello, little boy. Isn't he cute? Gotta miss him. I love having puppies. Well, thank you, Kira. Is that arm dirty? Is that arm dirty, Kira? Yeah? Is it dirty? You guys are going to be even more surprised when you have your dinner out here tonight. Yeah, you're going to be even more surprised. <laughs> She's eating me up. Oh, hi. Hi, handsome. All I hear is little <laughs> panting and licking. They're all excited. They just keep, they're all made their way over. None of them are shy. They're all pretty friendly, lovable little puppies. Look at this. That's Kira and uh, Caliber. Hi, Caliber. You're gonna go to a home that you have a bunch of big brothers. Yeah, you have a bunch of big Great Dane brothers. Some of them might even, actually, I think you're the only one this color. Hi. <laughs> Pounced right up here to get a kiss. Gotta give her a kiss. This lady probably wants a kiss. Yeah. Yeah. So I guess I'll go get their dinner ready. So they're having their dinner outside. So if they make a mess, it'll be easy to clean it. <laughs> they don't seem to care. Mm -hmm. 
I think they try to suck up all the juice first. Yeah, they do. Get your foot out of it, sweet girl. That's why we always put a clean towel down so if they eat, it's not, they're not eating off. Oh my god, it's all over her, her pink collar. She said you bring the critters out here? Hi, Haley. What you doing, Kitty? Does she like to sleep over there? No, she's whining. It's her cat Haley. She's she used to play with when she was a kitten, play with the puppies that we had at the time, but now she mostly likes to be outside during the day. And at night actually. She said, What are you guys doing? Hey. <laughs> she's spayed, so. She doesn't like to be handled anymore, I guess. So once they have dinner, uh, their dinner, then we're going to put them back inside just so they can settle down. Mm, look at how fat their bellies are. Hmm. All done, huh? Well, uh, they're eating. Uh, how many do you think that holds? Two cups. Two cups soaked, plus it's formula still. We will be eventually um, weeding them off the formula, probably pretty soon, because when they go home, they'll only have water and kibbles. You ready to go, Bucko? Uh, all right, I guess we're ready to go in. Now that they scoured everything, did we miss any there? Escapees heading to their basket. They said this is the way we came out. She said, Oh no, we're done playing already. Cups of kitty. But that was pretty good. Normally, the first time I brought them out in the basket, they realized they could jump out on the ride going back. Huh. Yep. So their bellies are full. They're probably not that. Plus, they did play hardcore. All right, let's go in, guys. Ready for a nap. Hi, Bents. Hi, Benny. Benny, Benny, boo. Hi, it's gorgeous out today, huh, ladies? We don't jump. No jumping, Lady Jane. Are the birds talking to you guys? Stop jumping. I guess they're telling us they want to be fed, those birds. So this is Violet. She was bred about... Uh, a few weeks ago, we're still waiting. We gotta wait about 30 days to confirm. Um, hi, she's a sweet girl. She's really a big girl too, cause look, she comes right up to like my rib cage. And just in comparison to little Benny Boo here. Hi, Benson. <laughs> you said she's my lead girl. Yes, you just my lead girl. Oh.